Hey guys, welcome to part 3 of Let's Play Castlevania Harmony of Dissonance for the Game Boy Advance. It was on the last part I took out another victory armor and grabbed the energy circle, which I am not going to use because 1. It is weaker, and 2. It's for lazy people. Anyways, let us move onward to the Shrine of Apostates, to where we need to go, which was in the opposite direction of where I was going in the first place. Oh, well, these other men are very profound with their rapiers. Too bad I won't do them any good, because I'm skilled and they're, well, not. They're just plentiful and annoying. Besides, if I had the energy circle on, I'd be doing less damage to them. Thus, they are not required. What was over here? Over this end. Uh, fill in that part of the map, did I? Yeah. No reason for me to be here then. I'm a perfectionist when it comes to a Castlevania map. I don't know why. There we go. Ooh, monies! Only 25 bucks though. I haven't even found the first shop yet. It's around somewhere, just not in this area. So yeah, hope you're enjoying this LP. I don't know what I'm gonna do after this, like, what will be my next LP. I think I'm doing something short. I like to do games that are long and then ones that are short to balance it out. Rather than have multiple long ones at the same time. Because then I'll just be too busy and too preoccupied. Uh, let's see... Uh, yeah, I think I'll just keep going straight forward to the left. Hmm, rock Armors. I wonder if they were the inspiration for Gutsman. Or if Gutsman himself was any inspiration. Uh, I don't like Ice and Cross. I don't know why, I just don't. Oh good, I got a potion. Ouch! Oh, good thing I was there. Take out that white dragon. There. I almost had a scare. Right next to a save point, too. How embarrassing would that be if I died and I was right next to a save point? Maxim! Are you alright? Oh, uh, Eust, is that you? I'm glad you're alright. Yeah, I looked up the pronunciation on Wikipedia. It helped me out. What's wrong with you? Standing around in a daze? These are vulnerable. I, uh, I think I've been in this castle before. What did you say? I, I can't clearly recall, but I think I've been here before. Your memory's coming back to you? It seems so. I feel like strange since coming to the castle. If we continue a little further, perhaps I may be able to recall something. Come on, let's go together, Maxim. No, if we're going to find Liddy, we must separate. We'll cover more ground. Hmm, yes, you are right. Be careful, Eust. Watch your back too, Maxim. Hmm, I wonder if this will have an impact on the game. Okay, I'll just stick to this sub-weapon. Take on the second boss, the Living Armor. Another easy boss, I might add. Depending on when you hit it, you'll, you'll actually knock it back. Just in case it's getting too close to you. I mean, this is going to be a common type of enemy you'll see in future Castlevania games. Like the big walking armor hulking back towards you, towards you. after a couple lucky hits, you'll knock it back. Like, this is not exclusive to this game. Got him! Right in the shins. And I shall do my epic buff! Oh, it only, it's only exclusive to the whip. Alright, now I got the lizard tail. Uh, might as well unlock that uh, shortcut. It takes you back to the entrance. Now I can slide. And yeah, the slide actually does hurt enemies. But I'm going to go back for the sole reason that there was a health max that I could get. I'm going to get it now. 
now that I can. So hopefully those lizard armors won't take up too much time. The ones that are in my way, guess what's gonna happen? Where is it again? I think it was over here. No, I think it was where I was before, just to the right. Too bad the slide doesn't kill him. If it did, I wanted to worry about taking damage myself. There we go, that's where the health was. Two lizard men with one shot. Nice. If I remember correctly, there was nothing hidden in the Wailing Way that, that I needed this ability for. I think I can just go on to the Marble Corridor, because there was one place I couldn't get to before. Whoops. Uh, I'm gonna get up there. Okay, I gotcha, I gotcha. Hey, <laughs> hey. <laughs> ah, that wasn't my best Nelson, Nelson Muntz impersonation, but whatever. It's like, ha <laughs> ha! That's a little better. It seemed a little forced. That doesn't matter. Uh, am I going the right way? Yes, I am. Oh no, you bats are gonna have to die. Okay, there's the save point, and this is where I need to go. Well, actually, it's not required, but if I want to get the fire book, I do. Ah, uh, summer clothes. Okay, what does the summer clothes do? Okay, it lowers my defense, but increases my intelligence, which is good for my magic and magic regeneration. I think I'm gonna put it on. Sure, I'm gonna lose defense. Who cares? I don't get smacked around too much. This has to be a good source of magic. Okay, time to head back to that area I was in the first video by mistake. This time to go all the way down. I might as well just equip the fire book just to show it to you. Seeing as though it's new. Uh, personally, I prefer Ice and Bible better, but I'm going to stick to using Fire for now. Nice toss set! I heard some Mario hacks use that. Nice! Level up. Hey, my heart counts as 69! Haha, <laughs> 69. Ow. I still dash and I still got hit. No, that don't matter. It's all for nothing. Okay, so then that's my max hearts now. 71. Nice. Too bad I've been using haven't been using hearts at all since I got the uh, spell books. Ooh, a bandana. Uh, JV's bracelet. I don't really need that. I'll need it later, but not right now. Uh-oh, trippiness. Oh yeah. Woot! More hearts. Oh, a lucky charm. I think I'm gonna equip it now. You know, since people are out to get to me lucky charms. I lose defense, but I rather luck. It helps me with critical hits and gaining items for enemies. For some reason, things look a bit different than they did before. Yeah, I think it's the color. But yeah, there's more to this later. I'm not gonna spoil it to you now, but trust me, this is gonna be a common theme for the rest of this game. I mean, just look outside. I mean, 
Everything's just look a bit darker and more evil. I mean, earlier when we were outside, it was just a night sky. Now it's just red. Makes you wonder. Okay, I think I got time for one more enemy, like the Feather Demon, and then I'm gonna stop recording. Oh, I beat him already. Uh, life max up, and here's a hidden door. Well, it's not so hidden, but it's new. I'm gonna need a different key for it, but I'm gonna stop the video. I'm out of time. Goodbye, everybody.